Uh, this question I have taken from a year nine exam uh, of CBSE, uh, which is an exam board of India. Now, when you look at this example, you may wonder how can you do this or how can year students do in year nine? And, but that's the reality. In India, maths can be at a crazy level, even at a junior school. OK, the question is simplify the following expression. Uh, which is 3 root 2 over root 6 plus root 3 plus root 6 over root 2 plus root 3 minus 4 root 3 over root 6 plus root 2. Now this is a third form and you want to simplify. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to individually take each of them and simplify and then I'll add the whole thing. Okay, so let me take the first that is 3 root 2 over root 6 plus root 3. Okay, I can see a root. Okay, so I can see a root 3 here and a root 6 here. So, and a 3 here. So, this 3 I can write as a root 3 times root 3 times root 2 over the denominator I can write as a root 3 times so root 2 plus root 3. So the numerator I'm going to leave as it is, which is root 3 times root 3 times root 2. And in the denominator, what can I do? I can factor out this root 3. So if you factorize root 3, you'll have root 2 plus 1. And what will happen is root 3 and root 3 gets cancelled. So what is remaining is, this is root 3 times root 2, which is root 6 over root 2 plus 1. Now this you have to rationalize. Okay, therefore I can say uh, this, again I'll write this, that is 3 root 2 over root 6 plus root 3 is root 6 over root 2 plus 1. Now to rationalize, rationalize the denominator, I have to multiply by the conjugate, which is root 2, which is root 2 minus 1 over root 2 minus 1. So basically you have multiplied by 1. So this is 6, root 6 times root 2 minus 1 as it is over. This is root 2 squared minus 1 squared using difference of 2 squares, which is nothing but root 6 over root 2 minus 1. Because this is, okay, let me write that. This is root 2 squared, which is 2 minus 1, okay? So this simplifies to, let me write this here. Uh, okay, uh, where can I write? Okay, so let me find some space here. Okay, so let me write the simplified form, which is nothing but root 6 times root 2 minus 1. This is the simplified form of the first third form. So this simplifies to, let me change color, uh, which is root 6 times root 2 minus 1 is a simplified form of this. Okay, so let me use a different color, mm, say black. This is root 6 over root 2 plus 3. Now you can't simplify this, so I'm going to image, uh, directly going to multiply by the conjugate. So which is root 2 minus root 3 over root 2 minus root 3. Okay, so which is 6 or root 6 times root 2 minus root 3 over this is 2 root 2 squared minus root 3 squared, which is nothing but root 6 times root 2 minus root 3 over 2 minus 1, 2 minus 3, sorry. So this simplifies to uh, root 6 times root 2 minus root 3 over negative 1. Now to take care of this negative 1, I don't want this, I can flip this over. So this is simplifies to uh, root 6 times root 3 minus root 2. So this is the simplified form of the 
second third form so root 6 so let me use a different color for blue for this which is root 6 times root 3 minus root 2 is a simplified form of the second okay and finally brown color the last expression which is 4 root 3 over so so you got 4 root oops you got 4 what's the question 4 root 3 over root 6 plus root 2 so we can simplify this a little before we multiply by the conjugate this is 2 times 2 times root 3 over root 3 times root 2 plus root 2 which is again this 2 can be written or I'll write, leave this 2 as it is so this is 2 times root 2 times root 2 times root 3 over I can factor out the root 2 so if you factor out the root 2 you have root 3 plus 1 and now you can cancel 1 root 2 so this becomes this is 2 times root 6 over root 3 plus 1 okay so now I'm going to multiply by the conjugate which is root 3 minus 1 over root 3 minus 1 so this becomes 2 root 6 over root 3 minus 1 over this is root 3 squared minus 1 squared which is 2 root 6 over root 3 minus 1 over 3 this is 3 minus 1 which is 2 so this 2 and this again 2 gets cancelled so the final form is root 6 times root 3 minus 1 hopefully I've not done some silly mistakes so let us see okay so this simplifies to what's the answer uh, the answer is root 6 times root 3 minus 1 okay so this is root 6 times root 3 minus 1 okay so we need to I'll not delete this this much I need working space here okay so this I, I think this is enough so this simplifies to root 6 times root 2 minus 1 plus root 6 times root 3 minus 2 minus uh, root 6 times root 3 minus 1 so what can you factor out I can factor out the root 6 so you have root 2 minus 1 plus root 3 minus 2 and you got a minus here be very careful which is minus root 3 plus 1 okay because because of this minus plus root 3 becomes minus root 3 and minus 1 becomes plus 1 so what gets cancelled you uh, so root 3 minus root 2 oops I did a mistake here because this is root 3 minus root 2 oops I will use a smaller eraser okay so yeah this was root 6 times root 3 minus root 2 okay let me bring back my brown color so this is if you're factoring out at root 6 is root 2 minus 1 plus root 3 minus root 2 that's fine minus root 3 plus 1 okay so now what happens so this is uh, plus root 2 and minus root 2 gets cancelled plus root 3 and minus root 3 gets cancelled minus 1 and plus 1 gets cancelled so this is nothing but 0 okay, so this is amazing so which is root 6 times 0 which is nothing but 0 okay this is the beauty of maths that this whole thing becomes zero hopefully I've not done any silly mistake and if I have done you can contact me see you in the next video